Hey fam, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and hope the same for you. If this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome, namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And thank you so much for the support. And if you can, if you have not already, like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell if the bell is working so you can be able to know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you resonate with my video, please give me a big thumbs up. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love to get the positive feedback. And thank you again for the support. And for my returning subs, what's up fam? Thanks for the love and support. Namaste as always. Love and blessings. Love and light. And many blessings are yet to come for you. And thank you so much for the support. Today my video is about Twin Flame 101. Did anybody feel the shift during the blue moon eclipse? It's just been so much stuff they've been saying. It, it's just like I've been looking it up because it was just like, hold, hold up, wait a minute. <laughs> Things are not the way they felt like, like last week or the week before. They just started getting really intense. Like, I don't know if it felt like I was going through an ascension phase or anything like that, but... It was like more memories was coming back, especially with, you know, my me memories like really messed up, especially during my childhood. So it's just a lot of things that happened to me that really I didn't think that was significant to me really came back. And that was like crazy. I'm like, why would this come back? Like I can be in the middle of doing something and boom, here it comes. And it was like emotional, but it was a good thing that I was able to you know to experience that again even though it was like really intense but not you know it wasn't to a point where i would get really upset but it was just something that you know okay hey i need you to you know need you to remember that because everything happens for a reason but it's like since then i've been really tired like i had literally take you know a 24 hour to 48 hour break um, because I, I felt so drained. I don't know what it was, but I just felt drained. Like I was just going to go save the world for like about two weeks and came back and it, it just sucked the life out of me. So I had to just really, really just recuperate because I just didn't want to make a video right after that because it was just like, I did not want to send those kind of vibes out because I was just tired guys. You can see like black marks all, all up under my eyes and it just really didn't look good. <laughs> So, you know, I don't know if you guys had that kind of problem, but it was just like a lot of things like my emotions were like a roller coaster. Like really, I don't, I'm trying to figure out how can I really explain that. But it was like more intense than it usually is because I could be happy one minute, frustrated the next, and then be emotional the next thing. And then I'm just feel like I'm ready to conquer the world like I had a big glass of coffee. So I was just like, where are these feelings coming from? So, you know, as usual, I'll just go on YouTube and I just start looking at all these different videos and I'm like, oh, okay, this is where all these are coming from. So it was just like my dreams are more intense. I would just wake up at weird hours. Like I usually wake up like around six, seven o'clock in the morning. Now I'm waking up five, five thirty. I'm just trying to figure out where is this coming from? I, you know, I usually don't wake up that early. So, I mean, it's just like my eating habits is going crazy. I've been craving peanut butter and lollipops. And I don't crave those two things, but I say I love peanut butter, but it's just lollipops is never really my thing. But lately I've been having them. So, you know, I don't know if you guys have these different issues, but if you have, please drop me a line so I know I'm not by myself. <laughs> but I know a lot of people has just been experiencing these things. So, you know, maybe... You know, these things that happen, you just probably didn't notice or whatever. Because a lot of people don't feel like they, you know, their their emotions or any kind of frequency change. But especially if you're an empath or any kind of, you know, empathetic person, it just seems like when you're going through these shifts, you're going through them hard. So, you know, if you guys have any of these issues or whatever, please let me know. Drop me a line or two to let me, you know, go ahead and comment on your, on your comments or whatever. Reply on them. And it will greatly be appreciated. And I will see you on my next video. I hope everybody is being safe and be responsible at everything you do. I will keep you in my prayers. And I hope you'll do the same. And, you know, drop me a line or two. Hit the notification bell. 
go ahead and subscribe and I will talk to you later. Peace and be wow. Much love.